Today is a day you will always remember, the greatest in anyone's life. You'll start off the day just two people in love and end it as husband and wife. It's a brand new beginning, the start of a journey with moments to cherish and treasure. And although there'll be times when you both disagree, these will surely be outweighed by pleasure. You'll have heard many words of advice in the past when the secrets of marriage were spoken, but you know that the answers lie hidden inside where the bond of true love lies unbroken. So live happy forever as lovers and friends. It's the dawn of a new life for you as you stand there together with love in your eyes from the moment you whisper, I do. And with luck, all your hopes and your dreams can be real. May success find its way to your hearts. Tomorrow can bring you the greatest of joys, but today is the day it all starts. And Philip, would you like to take Haley's ring from Scott and hold it on the third finger of Haley's left hand? while you say these words to her. All that I have, all that I, have I, give you. I give you. All that I am, all that I, have, I, share with you. I share with you. I give you this ring, I give you this ring with, all my love. with all my love and ask you to wear it, and ask you to wear today, it. And always. today and always. And if you'd like now to place the ring on Hayley's finger. Because that's not amazing, isn't it? <laughs> I don't know how. Sometimes, sometimes things are a bit small. That's really funny. Now Hayley, can I invite you to take the ring from Scott and if you'd like to hold the ring on the third finger of Philip's second hand, why do you say these words to me? All that I have, all that I have, I give, I give you all that I am, all that I am, I share, I share with you. I give you this ring, I give you this ring with all my love, with all my love, and ask you to wear it, and ask you to wear it today, and today and all, if you'd now like to place that ring. <laughs> <laughs> That was well, a struggle. Uh, it's pretty <laughs> and can I say thank you very much to Scott for being the ring bearer and best. And as the sun comes out, <laughs> I'm really pleased to say that you have both consented to be married and have made the legal declarations required by law in the presence of your witnesses, your families and your guests. And therefore it gives me great pleasure to declare that you are now legally married to one another and are husband and wife. <laughs> Congratulations! <laughs>
<laughs> Google last night, you know what I mean? All right, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name's first introduce myself. For those who don't know me, I haven't bought me a drink yet. My name's Scott, I'm on JD and Coke. I'm absolutely honored to be standing here today and humbled that I'm asked to be Phil's best man. I've never been the best man before. I'm not renowned for bank speech rating, but I'll try my best, because Phil said I'd do a good job today. I can be his best man at his next wedding. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to say a big thank you to the bridesmaids and flower girl of course for today. As you'll agree, they've done a great job and look lovely. The only eclipse by Haley herself who looks fantastic of course. In fact, everyone who played part today looked great and made today perfect. Even the grooms have performed well, dragging Phil down the stairs towards the altar. <laughs> I think I can agree today that it's been truly amazing so far, such a great venue and it's been a miracle with no hilarious YouTube videos have happened yet, but it's still early. <laughs> Before I continue, I'd like to make a toast to a special group of people who without today would be a disaster. Ladies and gentlemen, to the bar staff. <laughs> but I'd like to make a special mention to the lads who went to Phil's stag last week. You all made a great laugh, I let them wear the go-karts, made it very memorable for Phil. <laughs> let them win that. <laughs> So where do I start with Phil? I've known Phil such a long time and being his best man, it's my duty to tell embarrassing stories. I must say, if you're looking for that today, I'm afraid you're going to be disappointed. The truth is, I've stood side by side with him for many years now. Through ups and downs and all that time, I've never seen anything but a, in, a man of integrity, honour and good character. In addition, I was usually with him with my neck and most of it, so I'm not going to keep them quiet, you know what I mean? I first met Phil when we started our mechanic apprenticeship in the rocket training. Along with James and Warren, it was a funny, memorable time. From buying dodgy fireworks to letting hamsters run in our classroom, it was a truly entertaining each week. Our tutor, Mr. Bill Van Geffen, was nervous rep by the end of our class each week. <laughs> Phil was a natural mechanic from day one, taking on the family gene and skill from his grandfather, who used to run his own wagon and skip firm. I'm sure he'd be very proud that the man Phil has came today. Being an old child myself, I see Phil not only as your best mate, but as a brother, and I could not be prouder of him. Aww. So, I'd like to raise a glass, even though it's empty. <laughs> Everyone, to love, laughter, and happily ever after, as Phil and Haley start their new life, please stand and toast to the new husband and wife. To Mr. and Mrs. Chandler.